Hey, it's me Dave. Uh, I'm here with Fox from Losant and uh, they've created a really cool uh, demo here. Uh, basically Losant is a uh, IoT service that helps you collect your data and, um, from your devices and uh, they've put together a pretty cool device right here. So um, uh, Fox, why don't you tell us yeah. Uh, what about the company and, and about this kind of cool uh, manufacturing plant? So those things, what we do is we're an IoT cloud platform. And to demo this, we created something what our customers will create. So this is a smart factory. So here we have two stations, a vibration station and a UV light station. So in this demo, what we're doing is we're creating plastic balls. But ignore the fact that the balls are actually metal. We have two Arduino 101s. This Arduino is actually measuring the vibration of this station. It has an onboard accelerometer. And there's another one over here with the photocell resistor that's measuring the light. And what's going on here is that these two are connected to the Intel Jewel via Bluetooth. And this Jewel is serving as a gateway to our platform. And what's happening is every couple times a second, it's sending it to low And that's what you can see here in this debug output. So at this point, now we're gathering all this data so we can start to make sense of it. So now we can have a cool dashboard to show status and to visually see a history of what's going on. And then on the other end, we can take a look at our workflow engine so now we can react to this data. Now we can say, all right, you know what, let's make certain things happen once we get certain payloads. So just as an overall, now with a dumb factory, now we can have it smart, connected, and actually react to data and make ourselves more productive. Very cool, and I noticed uh, you got Redis in here, which is cool. I always love Redis. Oh, yeah. And uh, and you said earlier that uh, somehow there's some container or uh, serverless or some sort of container technology going on in there. Oh yeah, so like every workflow itself runs in like in its own independent environment, so it's very secure. Uh, this workflow example, what we're actually doing here is that every time we get a payload, it's running some kind of additions to make sure everything's good, right? And it's actually powering this, Alexa. Ask Losan, how's the factory doing? Here is your factory status. UV output is lower than expected. Vibration levels are within tolerance. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty cool. Yes, yeah, so, so you're connected to and from. Exactly. <laughs> so we can provide direct communication. We can send good data from the device and also send data back out to the device to like stop the factory if we needed to. There's a bunch of different ways you can use our platform. Very cool. Well, thank you very much for sharing. And uh, we'll see you next time. Oh, Dave, you're awesome.